What's going on guys? JNM Studios Gaming here. I am Michael. And today I'm bringing you a brand new video. Um we're going to do a career mode on franchise. I'm just going to create them and we're going to do week 1 of the NFL season. Uh, we're probably going to do a quarterback cuz that's you know, that's the most obvious position. It's not really the most obvious, but you know, it's most popular. So we're gonna go with that. Excuse me. Um, a couple things. One, if you want me to keep doing this, and if you have any suggestions at all, I'll take them. Also, if you wouldn't mind hitting that subscribe button, it only takes a few seconds, and hit that notification bell so you'll never miss a post. Uh, we would really appreciate it. That's mostly it. Um, I think we can get started here. Uh, not clouded. I do not have PlayStation Plus at the moment. Also, in the description below, I'll put my Instagram and my PSN and Xbox. Send you, if you want a 1v1 me and call me your Madden. You could do that. So, yeah, that's it. I think we can go ahead and start playing. Uh, a couple, I think, I'm trying to think of a couple other things. Um,. Oh yeah, this is my first um, pre-recorded episode. I'm going to start doing it, so then like, I'm going to record the episode the day before, and then the next day, like, when we're watching the video, when it comes out, then, like, you'll know. You know what I mean. Um, Chargers are kind of good. I'm going to, I want to choose a team that's like, that's good. That would be good if they had a quarterback. I already know. If the Jaguars had a good quarterback, Start your season you already know. If you wish to change roles or adjust options, use the We're going to create right. a player. Defense. We're going to do pocket passer, superstar development, it has quick development, in the 60s overall. Low 80s overall. Wow. Okay, just then we could start, like our career. I'm gonna do early draft pick. Just then we could probably be a starting quarterback. Okay. Obviously, I'm not gonna put my real name. Oh yeah. What was I saying? Um, I tried to record a rebuilding um the Coyotes video on NHL. But, like, it was so ridiculous. Like, I put a f two first round draft picks for that same year, and a first round draft pick for the next year in some, like, right wing, and they wouldn't accept it. It was ridiculous, so I wasn't gonna put up with that. Now, let's do 14. Um. Okay. going to be from the Arizona state itself. Six, Yeah, we're going to put arm size up there. Yeah, look at those biceps, bro. boy. I'm sorry for the cringe right there. I'm going to have that Peyton Manning kind of helmet. I think... 
I think he has a two bar. I'm gonna a two bar. He's gonna look awesome. We're throwing with her right hand. Oh, I thought the power move, that's cool. Um, our left hand, I wanna do binary. And we could probably do take, cause that's her throwing. I don't know, is it opposite? Like, do you have a glove on your throwing hand, or? I don't know. We're gonna do obviously we're gonna have a hand warmer because our other hand is gonna be taped so it's gonna be cold. Uh, styles I think that should I don't care about that. We're an 83 overall, okay. The weak settings, we're gonna be fair obviously. We're gonna put instant starter off. Cause that just wouldn't be like I like, fair. Obviously, I want to freeze this stream that's off. Obviously, we are going to play week one today. Auto, auto, auto. Progress. Yes, yes, yes. Your season, Your season starts, starts, now. starts now. Indeed, it does. Obviously, if we are not a higher overall than Blake Bortles, then it should be the second string. Because I believe he's in like an 85 overall in this game. Are the first string. Let's do 3,500. Pass me. Really? I thought we would be the second string. Let's play portals overall. Oh, he's an 81. When do you see that? I did not know that. Okay, so we're gonna we're the first string. That's surprising. Week one, we play the Texas. I'm so stupid. Houston Texans. I'm sorry. I'm like tired right now. It's on pro. You know, not too hard, not too easy. I usually play on all pro, but I think that might be too hard for this career. It just says T boy. Oh, I should just made. I should have made his butt like really fat, so it would have made sense to be thick boy. Waiting on you. There we go. Right when I said that, that's cool. Hello, everybody. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. It's the beginning of a new era for this. Obviously, the game is going to go by a little faster because it's simulating all defense and stuff. That's why, I like, oh, wow, it's real life. The Patriots lost Week One, so that's kind of like I like play action. Also, I think if Pro gets a little too easy, 
then I think we're going to switch to All Pro eventually. Like if we're just going undefeated and Pro is too easy, then I'll switch it to All Pro. So it won't be like we won't go undefeated. It'll be a little more fair, if you know what I'm talking about. There will always be a place for methodically marching the ball downfield. It's zone. I'm not going and strike like that, have explosive plays. That's mm, often the difference in winning hurts. and losing. Those types of plays that can knock a defense off balance, that'll drive a team towards a victory. Are you... He couldn't quite hold it. Got hit. Ball pops out. Jeez, look at those biceps. And as a first rounder, a lot of eyes on him, a lot of expectations. And he has to play well in his rookie year. Those days of coddling guys and bringing them along slowly, those days are long gone. When you're drafted in the first round, they expect you to play right Alan away. Robinson's going to you, boy. They'll be on you the entire way. They added a lot of talent to a roster that really needed an infusion of youth. They got a very good infusion of youth. And they didn't I want to be max to protect anyone, every time, to just to be fair. Got the best players they could at the time they were drafting. And inserted them into their lineup. And I should not have done that. Off. Surprising to see a defender of his caliber let it get away, but it does get away and it's second down. I have so no idea what they're playing. Brings up second down. I think they're in field green, so we should get at least a field goal if we get a first they're round. Look to throw. Are you? Yeah, maybe we're not going to I did max protect too. Jeez. I did max protect. That says something. My dad used to tell me all the time when you're going ready to play a big time game, especially when I know we're not going to be the GOAT. One thing good about the Jaguars, Jaguars have a good defense. Shop on offense, and Charles, it's a yeah. question with them that I feel like we've asked many times before. Is this the year you think that they turn it better off the big boy? 2017, <laughs> having missed the playoffs for a ninth consecutive year. And until Jacksonville answers that question affirmatively with a playoff run and a playoff appearance, we keep asking that question, and rightfully so. Look, they've had excellent drafts over the last three, four, five seasons. Most of that I'm going to be defense. passing it a lot. This I don't year, they think I'm going to be handing it off very often. Blake Bortles. They were Leonard Fournette, the big runner out of LSU. Cam Robinson, the offensive tackle out of Alabama. They want to control the ball a little bit more, and they think if they can do that, play better on offense, they can make a run in the AFC South. A good pick up there, 26 yards. They'll look to throw. Oh, that was dangerous. Threw it into coverage almost. Come on. Picked, but instead, they'll keep it on second down. I know our vantage point might be a little bit better way up here, but that looked like an ill-advised throw to me. I didn't see anything open, and this play just didn't look right from the beginning. It did not. I thought he might get outside and just chuck it away. Dangerous pass incomplete. Hold on to that. We're three and nine for 67 yards. That is not good at all. Physical group, and we just saw it there on that play. It came in, made the contact, just as he's trying to haul it in. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. Looking left side, and he's got a man. It's Cole, and he gets this one all the way down inside the 20-yard line. A good pick up there at 20 yards. Now a play fake here on first down. And his throw is in. Try to throw it in. Uh, so you can catch him in traffic. Never force the ball into double coverage. Especially not this close to the goal line. The windows yeah, are so tight. Yeah, I can tight. feel it. Right here. It's going to be tipped up and picked off. Green 39. Green 39. Back to throw now on second and 10. And the hit jarred it loose. Well, maybe not. It's incomplete. They kind of forced that one there, didn't he? It's almost like he predetermined where he was going to go with the football. Yeah, he wasn't really going through progressions. He wanted to go to his top guy. You do that against this defense, they'll make you pay, won't they? Yeah, they certainly will. They react very quickly to the thrown football. And he can't hang on to it. Nearly picked. It's disappointing. He's for his hands defensively, but instead it just brings up.
We got the field goals in our lead. Here comes the Jaguars offense as they get set here. And after the field goal last time, we'll see what they can get here. And at least they got points out of the last drive, Charles. I never met an offensive coach that didn't want to drive to end with a kick. <laughs> Most of them want to end with a PAT, right? In this case, a field goal, they'll take it way I'm sorry about that, guys. My mom came in the room. You, you could just, like, skip ahead. They weren't happy with that field goal. I haven't met a fan base yet that wants to drive down with a kick. And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Second and long. Sorry, you guys, you could just skip forward. On play action, they'll throw. I did not protect. And he goes down once more. Christian Covington. I literally did max protect. Do the Jaguars have the worst O line in the league or something? The bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. Airing it out for Hearns. It's caught inside the 25. So one corner in the books on NFL kickoff weekend. And they're on the move here. They've got it first and ten. And on the outside, they're if playing they get press a coverage. Them, winning by three. I mean, if they make a DFT. They'll look to throw here on first down. And he's got it. And he takes it in. Touchdown, Jacksonville. Mercedes Lewis from 21 yards away. Reminded that later tonight, we'll see the Giants and Cowboys battle in Dallas. Seems like they're always playing in week one. And then on Monday night, a doubleheader. Yeah, Adrian Peterson, his first game with the Saints. He's already back in Minnesota to play the Vikings. And then a 10-20 start on the East Coast. It's the first game for the L.A. Chargers traveling to Denver. A nice AFC West matchup. Give him 30 yards there. So in the second quarter, he's already up over 100 yards receiving now. And isn't 100 the magic number for a really good game for a receiver? So you got a chance to really shatter that and have a profound effect on this game. He'll look to throw. Dang it. Lucky to get away with one there. That one nearly picked. Eight. Second down. Eight. <laughs> And not to get too overcritical there because he knows what he's doing, but his shoulders looked a little off kilter there when he threw there. I don't think you're being overly critical there. You're just analyzing it, and he gets those shoulders right. That pass will go from incomplete to complete. Now he'll look to throw here on second and ten. He's going to let this one go. This no way he caught that. There's no way he caught that. 
This is first and goal in the Jags last year. Just eight rushing touchdowns, second fewest in the NFL. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Got his man. It's caught. Touchdown, Jaguars. Here comes the Jaguars. I hope this video isn't that long because it looks again. long then. For them a touchdown, their last it's going to take a long time to do that again. And when you start oh, great. For, he's gonna go down for a fourth time I should have done Max for time, 10. The result is a safety. I've been doing max protect almost every time, well, the Jaguars and I'm still getting go. crushed. And last time they surrendered to safety, we know they don't want to do that again. That is just one of those oddities in scoring that we get, and it's just so strange to see that go up on the board, and then you got to make sure that that doesn't happen to your team again. They've got to take care of the ball. But boy, it juices up the defense. Oh, without a doubt. That's a great way to score some points. A really nice gain of 25 yards. Back to throw here. Throw left side complete. That's Lee. And he's going to get this down to the 35-yard line. A good pick up there of 20 yards. They'll look to throw here. Incomplete, but a penalty flag is down in the That should be field. on defense. Let's get the call. If it's not, I'm going to be mad. Oh, my gosh. Jeremy Parnell, you are getting cut. If it feels my attention, you would be cut right now. And you know darn well the offensive line coach is frustrated and upset that he's been hit that many times already. He doesn't really care that they hold now. Just don't let him get hit anymore. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. How did you drop that? Well, then, 23. That would have been a great catch, but it's real difficult to hold on to it because it was contested all the way. Would have been a great play if he'd been able to hold that one in. Now back to throw. Oh my gosh. This is so gay. I'm doing max protect. And there was no excuse for that. The Jaguars on third down. They've hit two for four thus far. This will be third and a mile. They'll set up to throw. And he couldn't Dude, hit I'm done. Through the contact. I'm so done. Incomplete. Our O line's so bad. comes the Jacksonville offense as they get set to take over here. How, out in front how are the Steelers tied with the Browns? We'll see if they can add to their lead now. They don't want to go out and, and punt it away. Again. Oh my goodness, dude. This is so retarded. I'm sorry if anyone watching this got offended by that, but oh my god. This is so stupid. Six sacks given up in this one. Six sacks, and it's not even halftime yet. Is our O line really that bad? God. Dude, I'm trying so hard not to just yell in the mic right now. This is just a bull game, dude. This is so bull. The Jags offense now gets set and heads back onto the field. We have seen a lot of points here in this quarter. For us up here in the booth, it's been fun to watch. The defensive coordinators probably scratching their heads. Yeah, they're going a little bit crazy right now. But let's face it, all of our friends who play fantasy, <laughs> they're enjoying the heck out of this show because most of them are creating and getting a bunch of points. Yeah, points certainly not at a premium here. He'll drop to throw. He's got his man on the crossing route. The Jaguars going to go ahead and use their first timeout as they'll stop it with just over 40 seconds to go in the first half. 
So here we go, first and ten now. They'll set up a throw. Come on, we need a touchdown. And he gets it all the way down inside the ten to the five yard line. A good pick up there, a twenty-two. Again, he'll drop to throw. And he's got his big receiver, Robinson, for the Jacksonville touchdown. The last few seconds touchdown. Alan Robinson. Out come the Jaguars now as he'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. They have the lead now. They'll be looking for some separation here as we begin the third quarter. I like the way you turn that because now I think they go a little bit deeper into their playbook. They like what they did in the first half. That worked okay. But in order to get the separation that you just talked about, change things up a little bit. Change your tendencies. Try and hit them a little bit more with some things they didn't see in the first half. Let's see if they do just that. He'll try again with the arm here on second down. It's caught right side. Come on, Hearns. Come on, Hearns. Let's go. There we go, Hearns. Now comes Jacksonville as they get ready to go. And they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline. Because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tab. Hearns again. Last drive. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to We're figure out how to fix one. things That's there. not that bad. Excellent pick up of 34 yards. Well, clearly one of his advantages as a passer is his height, sit back in the pocket, fired over the middle. That makes things tougher defensively, doesn't it? It really does because your goal is to move the quarterback off his initial spot when he gets his drop back completed. But when you have that type of height, he can stay in there. If he's willing to take the hits and just fire over the top, which saves him time and actually completes a play a little bit quicker than it normally does for a quarterback has to slide and find open space to throw. Looking to throw. His throw incomplete. Marquise Lee, the intended target, and it's third down. Well, the numbers have been good in the so passing right, game, this. and certainly a big reason why they have the lead. But now here, third we quarter, got maybe the run game a little more. Yeah, perhaps. I mean, after that incompletion, look credit to the defense for shutting them down on that play. Maybe you try and run the football a little bit more in this spot. But how about feel no? good about how they've been throwing it overall. It's a gain of 20 and picking up the first. He'll look to throw. Nice touch. His throw caught at about GG. GG Texans. Into the end zone for a Jaguar touchdown. Marquise Lee. 20. And out. Now comes Jacksonville as they get ready to go. After the long touchdown drive we just saw, you wonder if maybe that's taken a little of the wind out of this offensive sales because they had it going pretty good last time, too. Had to sit over there for a little while, didn't they? You know, they were eager, amped up to get back on the field after just scoring, hoping to get the ball back quickly. That didn't happen, so I'd say come out, just kind of get started again. You know, it doesn't have to be anything dramatic. Just get moving, get loose again, and see if they can get it downfield. Second and ten, he'll look to throw again. And that'll be incomplete. We do have a penalty. All flag these hits, I swear. However, let's see what that's about. It's on offensive line. Offense. Yep. Well, there have been a ton Who of sacks and known? just trying to prevent another. So what you're telling me is the conventional way has not really worked for them, huh? Not at all. Not at all. So he tries to grab him here, and they still get caught. Back to throw. And he finds a man on the crossing route. And he's brought down after a good game. A good pick up there, 26 yards. They'll drop to throw. I did max protect. This offensive line is trash. In there with pressure yet again, and that's 
the seventh time they've dropped him here this This afternoon. isn't even realistic how bad this offensive line is. Looking to jam the receivers at the line here. Press coverage look defensively. Back now here on EA Sports. You have to do max protect on a stupid quick play. Over the middle, the connection to Hearns. And he'll get up near the 45. They'll spot it at the 44. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. On third down, he'll drop to three. Oh, my. Dude, I am so done. I'm so freaking done. Why is this offensive line so freaking bad, dude? And now the game's tied because our offensive line can't guard. Comes the Jaguar offense now as they get set to take over. And a tight game after this is so stupid. I'm doing max protect. As they head to the field now, with the game this close. Oh my, and that's incomplete. I'm so. Dude, I only knew how mad I am right now. I really hate Madden sometimes. God, dude. Already with one interception, just missing a second there. Tremendous coverage there. Just did not catch the football. I really hate this freaking game. What do they say all the time? If he had really good hands, he'd be playing offense. Oh my. We lost. We lost because our offensive line sacked us way too many darn times. to start and stop after the ball hit the ground. I'm giving him some credit. I Jags. hate this offensive line the so much. They really get I really do. They can't do anything. To change momentum, big play, right in his hands, unable to come down with it. And a sigh of relief, no doubt, on offense if that fell harmlessly to the ground. Hearns brings it in. And he takes this one just shy of midfield all the way to the 49. He got 29 yards that time. They'll look to throw now on first down. He couldn't quite oh hold my. Get hit. Dude, hold the on to that ball. You're in the NFL for a reason. Dude, I'm so done. I'm actually done. The amount of sacks that they've absorbed in this game is absolutely I'm doing max protect almost every single play. It's been demonstrated time and time again. And this offensive line can't do anything to save their lives. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Oh, there's that man again. It's complete. Touchdown, Jaguar. Marquise Lee, already his second. Oh my goodness. This is not our way plan. I thought my day was going. To go. Last time they were out here, they had the benefit of good field position, led to a touchdown. This time, they're going to have to work for it. They are, but with that last drive, that culminating touchdown, I think they carry that confidence into this one. It doesn't matter where you start with the football now, they have to feel great about their opportunity. And he's brought down after a good game. A good pick up there, a 22. First down now, but that clock rolling. They'll look to throw. Looking middle, and that's complete. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. First down, Jacksonville. The passing game looking sharp on this drive for the Jags. 
Now a play fake here on first down. He's got his man on the crossing route. Now the defense going to use the first of their timeouts. And they'll be disappointed to have to burn one there after giving up the first down. Some good games going on in the early window. This might be the best of the bunch. Wrong play. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. Oh my! Free. The collision there jarred the ball loose and Hold brings up second down. Oh, dude. That's very well timed there, defensively, because it's not a bad throw, but the collision came at the exact time he's reaching to bring in the football. Really, really well done. Decent. Oh. Get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge dude, I'm. Oh my God! I'm holding in all my anger right now. I'm actually holding in all my anger right now. That time out, the defense back out onto the field. The Jaguars on third down. Not quite 50%. Four for nine. This is third and 16. Oh my God! Took a shot, couldn't connect. There's definitely contact there, but it's the fourth quarter of a kind of tight game, and sometimes the officials just say, let them play. Kind of like your mom used to, you and your brothers, just take the broom to you and send you out to the backyard and tell you to settle it yourselves. <laughs> they are in the fourth in Buffalo, and the Bills have wound up winning that football game. Kelvin Benjamin, a yard shy of 100. He's at 99 for the game. The Jaguars' offense now heads back onto the field. They have the three-point lead. Defense did their job. Now, late game. Although it looks good, you know the coaches, they haven't counted this as a victory yet. I agree with you totally. Big applause for the defense, but no one has taken their headset off on the sidelines. They don't believe this game is over. The How offense do we win, has dude? to close this one out by taking care of the football. And they'll try to close it out now. Got a little bit of my anger out. He's throwing a pillow across my room. I hate this game so much, dude. So now 11 yards Why to go for this, this offensive game? unit. It's second down. Over, 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 over. Here it is, the first NFL carry for Leonard Fournette. And he'll take this one down near the 15. Just a gain of a yard there, and now it'll be third down. The Jaguars on third down. I don't They're right at about the league won. average, 40%, 4 for 10. This is third and 10. Out on how we won our last week, this offensive line we get to can't together. do anything so to save the darn line. Had to be flag out there before the game, all the hoopla, just having football back so special. It is an opening day, opening when game, I tell you, I hate this like game sometimes. You really feel I mean, I hate this game for us. Is that crescendo lasts for a while? Opening game here. An entire season, we get into the playoffs, to the Super Bowl. I was really excited. I could barely sleep last night. I can't imagine being a player. So for the Whatever, guys. Like always, go down, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'm sorry, I'm just really tired. And angry at the same time. I'll see you in the next episode.